know, Minnesota State, no question, most talented team in our league. Um, they were the preseason pick on the, on the media side and also the coaches side to win the WCHA. Um, they've earned that with their NCAA bid last year. Um, they were home ice last year. Um, they returned most of their team. Um, probably the biggest loss was Arai Hayes. He was a you know big, strong kid. He added that goal scoring element, uh, you know, for Mankato. But holy moly, they've got you know they've got La Fontaine, they've got Leitner. Um, those kids, uh, those kids are good players. Palmquist is, you know, maybe the most skilled defenseman in the league. Williams had a heck of a freshman year in the net. So they just they're very deep. They're very deep up front. They've got a they got a very good back line. They have the ability of uh, scoring goals, and uh, they're a team who can put uh, put up four goals on any given night. And I think what you're going to see this weekend, I think you're going to see a team very similar to Minnesota. They have great speed. They've got very good special teams like Minnesota. And, um, you know, we're just going to have to be sharp, and we're going to have to make sure we take care of the puck. We're going to have to make sure um, that uh, we're good on the penalty kill because um, they really kick it around on the power play. And, uh, you know, it's just going to be it's going to be a tremendous challenge, but we're excited to play Mankato. And, uh, and uh, you know, it's nice having them at home, and uh, we'll see what happens. Well, absolutely. I mean, you want to win on the road, and uh, I guess it, maybe the question you're asking, can you bank one of those, do you feel like you can bank one of those wins? Because, um, you know, it's that old adage, you split on the road, and I don't know if you bank one of those wins, but there's no question that uh, I mean, it gives you a little shot in the arm, and hopefully, again, that kind of momentum from winning right, winning a, a series like that continues on this weekend, and uh, anytime you can win two games on the road, you'll take it, because it doesn't happen a lot. He's played well. Marcus is a nose for the net, and uh, He's shown that so far in the early going um, with the amount of offense he's generating. But uh, again, he's got a good stick. He's got a, he's got a high grit level. He'll play in traffic. He'll play inside the dots. And when you're willing to do those types of things, you're going to score some goals. And uh, again, he's just uh, he's a lot of, he's got he has a lot more confidence right now. When you're ready, he's getting more uh, he's getting more ice time. And with more ice time comes confidence. And with confidence, hopefully, comes more and more offense. I think it's kind of just the opportunity I'm getting this year. In a little more ice time uh, than last year, and I guess right now things are going things are going well. I obviously got we're getting, I was getting bounces on Friday night, and uh, I'd say it's probably just the opportunity right now. I really haven't, but I guess that makes sense. I mean, we are the two Minnesota teams in the WCHA, and um, we're going to play them four times every year because they are our, our travel partner, our rival, whatever you want to call it. Um, and so, I mean, obviously, I'm sure that. Uh, that puts a you know a little more emphasis on the series, and uh, that's fine. That's great, and I think it should be that way. And we have a long um, history um, with Mankato back to our small college days, so um, I think it's uh, I think it's fitting. I, myself, I've never played against Mankato before, but um, coming into the weekend, we know they're a, a highly touted team. You know, I, we know they're ranked number one, um, so we respect that for sure. Um, but we just want to get effort. You know, I, th I thought we had a great weekend last weekend and just have a good week of practice here and take that into that. You know, we know they're going to be a fast team and um, they got some offensive threats and Leitner and, and different players like that, but uh, I think we have our offensive threats too and, and uh, we should be good to go. Yeah.